months after the great quake crippled the Royal Palm Hotel, almost 700 explosions brought the building down. The spectacular sight took about 20 seconds, but people will be talking about the last moments of the Royal Palm for a long, long time. Hundreds of people from the cliff line on Marine Drive to ground level turned out to see the event of the decade. Originally scheduled for 6.20 this morning, the demolition of the Royal Palm Hotel was delayed half an hour while police tried to clear the area. We had some people, we had a communication barrier over by the Fujita Hotel Terrace, but as soon as we had officers over there giving them some sign language and, and tried to demonstrate what we wanted them to do, they cooperated and jumped right in the room. Finally, at 6.48, the dynamite exploded, resulting in this spectacular sight. Dust finally settled about five minutes later. People expecting two or three huge explosions were in for a surprise. The president of controlled demolition explains. There were about nine and a half seconds of internal charges going off. Uh, some of those were to, to stress certain areas that we had to move on early in, in controlling the building. The rest of them were to initiate all of the timing devices in the structure. Uh, we had 692 different explosives locations in both wings. Few people knew what to expect after all the hoopla leading up to the blast. Now the messy part begins. Cleveland Wrecking expects to spend two months cleaning up all this rubble. It took developers over two years to build the Royal Palm. It took controlled demolition less than 20 seconds to bring the resort down.